Sheriff describes it as one of the most horrific cases he's ever seen in Hayes County. A five-year-old girl stabbed and mutilated by her mother in Kyle. New at six, we have learned Child Protective Services has been involved with this family before, but CPS tells us the details are confidential. KXN's Lauren Landman spoke to a neighbor who says the home always appeared peaceful. Well over 24 hours, and police are still blocking the road that leads to the home where Crystal Villanueva killed her five-year-old daughter. Yeah, there's a tip around the, uh, the trees. Yeah, you can't get in or out. Martin Garcia lives next to the home. He says the word shocking isn't enough to describe his reaction when he heard what happened at his neighbor's home. It seemed peaceful and everything. Well, I feel sorry for that little girl. I mean, she's just starting her life, and uh, I don't know. It just surprised me. They've had some minor issues with law enforcement in the past, and to our, we have only had really one call at that residence. But the uh, suspect has had some minor issues with law enforcement in the past. Nothing really major issues. Hayes County Sheriff Gary Cutler says this was the first violent offense on record for the 24-year-old mother. According to court documents, her father-in-law Eustergio Uresti was making lunch when she began stabbing him from behind. He was able to escape from the home, but could hear five-year-old Giovanna Hernandez crying in the other room. For the entire sheriff's department, it's been an emotional case. It's a cold day here in Hayes County because our hearts are heavy here today. Villanueva is being charged with one count of capital murder and one count of aggravated assault with a deadly weapon. Her father-in-law has been released from the hospital. Deputies still aren't saying whether drugs or alcohol had any part of this attack, and they still don't know the woman's motive. Reporting live in Hayes County, Lauren Landman, KXAN News.